Hi, welcome to Mountain Models. Uh, this is my first update for my Imperial Fist project, which is part of Nick's New Year's Painting Challenge 2017. So today I've assembled um, the second support squad um, here um, for my army, who all have melt guns. And I've done the yellow painting on them, and I've also done the yellow armor color on their melt guns and the melt guns for the Mark 14. I've also uh, redone the yellow for my Praetor. This is because previously I was planning to have a different weapon arm, which I think I was having as a Paragon Blade. But I decided to switch him to have, I think it's the Sokai Power Fist, which is the Imperial Fist Faction one. So because of that, there was a uh, greyer area on his chest because the sword arm covered that, while the fist doesn't. So I've given him his new weapon arm and redone the yellow on him. Um, with him, I've left the shoulder pads off and I plan to do those separately uh, just because his going to be the army champion, um, I'd rather not have stuff get in the way, especially with the breach shield, I found with the breach shield on the test model I did with the shield, it really gets in the way when trying to do transfers and uh, battle damage and things like that, so I think with breaching shields it's better to leave the shield side charger off at least. Um, I also assembled my chaplain, who's just the chaplain from the Betrayal of Calf set, except I've switched him over to have a bolt pistol rather than a plasma pistol. And with him, I've painted him, done his yellow, and I've just started doing the other colours, so the grey, black on his shoulder pads, uh, his cape, started doing a backpack. Um, so, so that's what I've gone to, done today. Um, next, I'm planning to work on the support squad and chaplain and get those complete um, and then once I've got that done then I'll set a plan of which part of the project I'm going to do next. Thanks folks, catch you next time, bye.